Sebastian, important approvals have been received from the shareholders for an additional financial package. What does that mean for TUI's current financial situation? First, I'm very happy about uh, the decisions uh, today. It gives us a lot of stability for the uh, next month uh, and uh, for whole 21. Even in a more challenging environment, uh, which we actually don't expect. And what is your view on TUI's development for the coming months from a financial perspective? Tourism will be back to normal, tourism will grow. I mean, everybody experienced uh, today that uh, uh, we would like uh, to travel. So it's more a question when and not of if. And uh, therefore, uh, I think we are now very well prepared whenever we can uh, start. I assume it will be in a not too far uh, future, but uh, let's see. Sebastian, you have been with the company for a number of years and you have been responsible for cruises, for destinations, for hotels and resorts, also positions at TUI Deutschland. From the 1st of January on, you are the new TUI Group Chief Financial Officer. Um, what, you will, what will you be focusing on in your new role in the coming months and uh, quarters? First, we have to secure liquidity. That is really important. And uh, after the crisis, we still have a lot of debt and we have to do our utmost to reduce uh, our debt position. That is uh, one focus. And the second one is to support the business as much as uh, possible, because uh, good financial uh, control means uh, that the business de decisions are good and can be uh, taken well. So these are the two major. Great. Thank you, Sebastian. Thank you.